What up, what up, what up, Unbreakable Kicks Army. Yo, so this video, I, I definitely got to start it just a tad bit differently, man. Again, I know I made a post earlier today, but again, RIP to my boy Upscale Crack, man. All right, when I say I literally just seen him a month ago, like literally, yesterday was 30 days since I last seen him. And um, still speechless, honestly, but it was just break i'm about to dip out bro you know i'm going to my daughter's birthday party man let's catch a quick flick you know before i get up out of here so chopped it up with bro at the just nice convention army literally like 45 minutes like me and crack we didn't talk every day but when we linked up when we did see each other at the event it was just like we never missed a beat you know man so he's definitely gonna be missing the sneaker community you know prayers out to his family his little girl and um uh, man army like it, it, it just makes Every time something like this happens, you know, for me, it just resonate on hug your loved ones, bro. You, you just got to. Like, you would have never told me. Nobody could have told me that the flick I took with him, the picture I took with him 30 days ago was literally the last time I see, bro. You know? It sucks, Army. So, like, always, man, of course, you got to make sure you, you hug your loved ones. I literally been under my wife and daughter all day, y'all. I ain't even gonna hold y'all, man. Daughter had a two-hour chill eating practice. I'm there. Wifey all day today. Been around her too. So you know, I'm again. Just hug your loved ones. I ain't gonna keep this too too long, man. But you know, that one definitely hit, hit home today. It definitely hit home, man. But I do got the whatnot live stream. Let me get my energy back up. Do got the whatnot live stream army. You know, drop in Thursday. I'm going to still push it for Thursday for us to do the Whatnot Army. I got the pairs in. Air Jordan 1 First Flight Army. The quality on these joints is amazing. I got size 8 women through 11 and a half women. So I got uh, 6 and a half men through a size 10 in men army. Retail plus tax plus shipping right now. Now, if y'all want to wait to Whatnot, y'all can wait to Whatnot. But like right now, if you want to go ahead and grab them and I ship them out tomorrow... Pairs are available for you guys right now, Army. So make sure y'all take advantage of these, man. To me, the best Air Jordan one that's dropping this year. Also, for whatnot, don't forget, bro, Army, merch. I'm going to have like $5 shirts on there. Small and medium, myself and Conceited, our collab shirt. Doing them joints, $5. Merch going to be $20 if you use the promo code. Gratitude hoodies I'm going to have on there as well. Old merch, I'm going to have flight and some more stuff, man. Like, we're going to turn up. So make sure, again, Thursday, click the link in the description section below. If you sign up with the link in the description, Army, you get $15 off your first purchase. I don't know why y'all holding out, man. $15 off your first purchase. Even if you already bought from me, create a new account, get the $15, and do what you got to do, Army. Do what you got to do, man. Y'all know what time it is. Like I always say, you ain't... Yeah, it ain't like you're just sitting over there with one sneakers account. You got more than one, so make sure you get another account so that way you can get that $15 off. Link is in the description section below. Now, there's a couple shoes I want to talk about, Army. Y'all, look, 2025, I told y'all to start saving that bread right now. Sneakerhead made the post letting us know Varsity Red Nike SB4s are scheduled to drop. Spring 2025, retail is $225. So we get in the Navy joints, and we get in the Varsity Reds in 2025, Army, like... I'm telling y'all, this is going to be the year that I really feel like Jordan Brand is just stamping his dominance. It's so many bangers dropping in 2025. And if you missed the video that I posted yesterday, Z Sneakerhead dropped a video with some concepts of some sneakers that can potentially drop. Now, if y'all watch his video, I always say, Liberal always throw in some hints. So... If you check out the video that I posted yesterday, maybe you probably can figure out what sneaker y'all think will be dropping again. Or maybe you guys can get a feeling of what sneaker could be possibly dropping in 2025. But these Varsity Red 4s are a cop army. I said it last year that they should have started off with a blue or red. And we literally get in both colors next year, man. Like, I'm here for these. I still think that the Pine Green Air Jordan 4 SB will still be that most dominant one. But don't get me wrong, these new colorways could creep up. And again, more people like red and more people like blue than they like green. Well, at least I feel that way. I feel that way, Army. But needless to say, these joints going to do what they do next year. Tap in in the comment section below. Do let me know if you guys plan on copping the Air Jordan 4 SB Varsity Reds in 2025. Army, the next you on the list, 
I can't say I'm the happiest about y'all. I ain't gonna lie, I actually feel like the mock-up was way better. And we got a first look at the Air Jordan 1 Velvet Browns dropping next year via private selection and army. I, I don't know what the freak they doing with these joints, bro. Like way too much brown, like these, the mock-up, the speculated mock-up, hands down army, I was like, these could potentially be the best Travis Scott Jordan 1 lows that they dropped. And then we get these. <laughs> I'm just like, I'm literally trying to destroy the Travis Scott legacy with these shoes, bro. It, it hasn't gotten better, Army. It's getting worse. Like the Canaries, I thought the Canaries was going to be the least favorite colorway. Then I seen these. I'm just like, bro, y'all purposely trying to have people stop buying these. Like, this must be done on purpose. Now, I know they got two other colorways that's dropping next year, like a pink colorway. And then I want to say we're still getting like either the... Are we getting an olive or more? I don't even know the other man colorway we get it next year, y'all. The the Travis Scott's is starting to get to like the Yeezys as far as colorways where you literally can't keep up and all of the colorways are starting to look the same. But these right here, oh yeah, these gonna stand out. Then these gonna stand out there, bro. Like I, I don't know, Army. I, 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 it got me flustered for my words because I, who approved these? Who said like, yeah? These are a go. Now, I ain't even going to lie. When I first seen these, I'm just like, bro, private selection got to be trolling. They got to be trolling the, the audience. Like, I thought that this was a custom sneaker, and they just trying to call it the Velvet Browns. And then five minutes later, I see Z Sneakerhead posted. Because I text Z, I'm like, bro, private selection got to be trolling us, right? He like, nah, bro, these are real things. I'm just like, dang. Dang. Dang, that speculated mock-up. See... When the shoes don't look like the speculated mock-up and the mock-up looks good, it makes you don't even want these joints, bro. Like, y'all should have just hired my boy Z and let him come in and start designing some of these shoes, man. But, Army, y'all let me know how y'all feel about these. Air Jordan 1 Low OG Travis Scott's. I had high hopes on these, but... Y'all let your boy know in the comment section below. And last but not least, Army, the next joints? I can't hold y'all. The presentation is killing these, man. You know the Air Jordan 1 Trophy Room home pair released today in store, and it was only a 1,000 pairs. Now, you see the pair right here at hand. This is from Down South Kicking It on IG. And you can see you got the white swoosh, but the other differences is the material. Like, they went with that satin on these, but this material looks to be more like a leather army. Still got the same heel, but the joints also come with some dope features man again not only are they numbered out of a thousand pairs and this is number 707 out of 1000 but the joints also come with an autographed michael jordan poster and it comes with this dope graded trophy room card now i don't know if the card is worth anything it's not like it's a you know legit i, I can't even call it a card because it does come with it but y'all know with my pokemon cards you get the cards graded it is a graded slab Right, it is a greatest slab. Now these may be worth something down the line, but right now I'm seeing that the prices is up, y'all. Prices is two thousand plus, like on goat, and just like these ones, people get them in hand. I still feel like people are gonna move them. Again, we are in a time of sneakers right now where it's rare to make money off day to day releases. So when you get a chance to spend a hundred some bucks on a shoe and you can sell it for a thousand, fifteen hundred. Most people are going to do it. And we can't act like this was the, the best looking Air Jordan 1. Granted, it is a trophy room. Granted, it is a collab. But it's not like it's the first ones. It's not like it's a trophy room 5. It's still an Air Jordan 1 low. So I still feel like it has its limits. You know, it's not a Dior. To me, the home pair is a lot better than the away pair. If I was down there in Florida, had a Florida ID, all that good stuff, if I would have went for it, of course, I'm keeping my pair personally. I would still grab a size 11, 11 and a half. But it got to be for the right price. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't, I know I'm not going to get a pair for retail and I'm cool with that. But, you know, I got some stuff I can trade, but I'm still going to wait for that price to go down. We're going to check out and see what Arba has to say in the next couple days when they get more information on the Air Jordan 1 Trophy Room home pair. But I say, Army, don't go out spending that two, three bands right now. I know it's a couple people who, yes, you want them. It's a limited shoe. It's only a thousand pairs. It's only a thousand pairs, but that price gonna go down just like these went down too. 
It, they dang near the same shoe. Like, I can't see somebody say, oh, my God, I just absolutely hate these. And then they see the home pair. Oh, my God, I just absolutely love them. Like, I can't see them. They too similar. Small, minor changes. Like, that is like a PE version. You know how we got this situation right here, Army? Very close, but they are different, you know? So, why pay 5000 for these when you can pay retail plus tax for these, Army? Like, it's same shoe, but different, Army. But, again, I say hold that bread. Wait before you spend them thousands at the end of the day army y'all do what y'all gotta do so you smash that thumbs up for your boy army hit that notification bell for your boy let me know if you did wind up copping the trophy room home joints if you are in florida heck if you got 11 11 and a half hit your boy up maybe we can work something out let me know how you feel about the travis scott's let me know how you feel about the sb force army i love you guys i appreciate y'all for real for real man hug your loved one stand strong bro for real man again r.i.p my boy crack I mean, I love you guys. You got your boy Unbreakable. You got the Unbreakable Vault. Unbreakable Army stand strong like always. Most importantly, hug your loved ones and of course remain humble. And we out. I hit Unbreakable for the Yeezys. He the plug, call him when I need him. He's old stuff, but he get him easy. He was old him first season. The most beefy looking like two laps. Two laps cause your ass taking nails.